Back in the days before there were game apps, there was a popular memory game called Simon. The colors would light up in sequence on the board and you'd have to remember the color and press the button. It would get harder and harder as the sequence got longer. Well, now we're going to make our very own Simon game. To make your very own Simon game, you're going to need a few components. Some light up LED momentary switches, resistors, capacitors, and a couple of other things including an 18 Mega 8 pre-programmed chip. I'll show you later in the video where you can get all these parts to build your own. Let's get to work. The entire game will be built on this small circuit board. So the first thing to do is to get our four momentary light up LED switches and set those in place on the board. Then we'll flip the board over and solder all of those connections on the back. Now with any circuit building project, it's good to have a multimeter, one that has a continuity mode. Then you can use your probes and make sure your solder connections are good. The brains of this project is an 18 mega 8 chip and we'll be putting that in an IC holder. So we'll lay that in place right in the middle of the board. Pay attention to the small indent on one end because that'll be pin 1. Then we'll hold that in place by soldering all 28 of those legs. A couple of small capacitors are next and a leg on each of them will share one hole. We'll also be using a 16 MHz crystal oscillator for timing, so that'll be laid in place as well. To limit the current, we'll be using two resistors, a 100 ohm resistor for the LEDs and a 10K resistor for the microcontroller. The two final components are the small speaker that will output our beep sounds and the switch to turn Simon on and off. Those will just be laid in place for now and we'll make the solder connections later. In many of my electronic projects, we use a ground rail, which is a small piece of copper wire that we solder on one end of the board. This makes life easier for all the ground connections. Then it's time to get to the wiring. Now, for the sake of time, I'm not going to show you where each and every wire gets connected, but I am going to provide this schematic absolutely free on KipK.com, so grab it. We'll be using different color wires for the LEDs and for the buttons. This helps for troubleshooting so you can figure out what's what. Then it's time to peel back the little sticky tape on the speaker and place that on the board, and the circuit is done, but we still need power, so we'll be using a triple AA battery holder for that. Once the power connections are finished, it's time for the AT Mega 8 chip. So we'll make sure all the pins are straight and carefully insert that into the holder. Our DIY Simon game is done. Now, when you turn it on, at first it plays a little song, then the first color lights up. And when you get it right, it plays a little victory song to tell you so. And it continues challenging your memory. Now when the sequence gets really long and you don't remember it, it lets you know. The last thing we'll do to make it a nice compact game is to use screws, nylon spacers, and hex nuts, along with the other circuit board, to make a place for the AA battery holder and to make it more compact and neat. Now for all the details on how you can get this kit to build your very own, just go to kipkkits.com. There's also a link in the description. So that's how to make the classic Simon memory game before high tech took over. Going retro is fun, but for some things high tech is the way to go, especially when it comes to your razor. I've been loving the shaving experience I get with Harry's because their razors are incredibly high quality. They're sleek and sharp. In fact, since the holiday season is here, Harry's has you covered for that special guy. Whether it's your dad, brother, or that secret Santa gift for a coworker, forget the socks or a tie. Get creative and give them Harry's this holiday season. Harry sent me a sweet holiday shaving set that comes with a copper-plated razor handle, a couple of five-blade cartridges, shaving cream, and a cool travel kit to hold everything. And it's all in a stylish box that you won't even have to wrap if you don't want to. Holiday shaving sets start at only $15. So why not pick one up for yourself and one for every guy on your list? Now is the time to go to harrys.com. As a special offer for my fans, Harry's will give you $5 off your first order with code KIPK5. Don't wait. Economy shipping for the holidays ends on December 18th. So act now. That's H-A-R-R-Y-S dot com. Enter code KIPK5. Harry's makes every morning feel like a holiday. So happy holidays to you. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.